This is I'm Sonic, and in this video we are looking at integration and the area under a curve. So here we have a curve and by using this method and integration we can find out what this area is between A and B. And to calculate the area under a curve you perform a calculation using a definite integral and a definite integral is denoted by this. So we have the B, the A and then you're integrating f of x. But this will make more sense when we actually look at it in a question. And first of all, of this question, so we have um, the integral of x cubed plus x, and then this is between um, root 5 and root 3. So for example, if we were looking at this on a curve, you could say that um, as this is a at the bottom, well, this would be root 3, and then b it could be root 5. And then you're trying to find the area between these two points. But first of all, we're just going to integrate x cubed plus x. And we looked at how to do integration last lesson, so if you're stuck on this, then look at the previous video. But this will integrate to give 1 quarter x to the 4. plus a half x squared. Now this is where this comes in, f of b minus f of a, as now we have to do some substitution. And we've already established that root 5 is b and root 3 is a, and we're just going to sub in um, b for x each time in a for x and then um, do b minus a. So if we sub in b first of all, and if we sub that's uh, root 5, then what we're going to get is 25 over 4, and that's the a, a quarter x to the 4 if you sub in root 5 there. And if you sub in root 5 to half x squared, you're going to be adding 5 over 2. Then what you'll do is you'll minus the next bit, and the next bit is going to be by subbing a in, and a is root 3. So if you sub root 3 into a quarter x to the 4, you would get 9 over 4. And then sub in root 3 uh, to half x squared, and you'll get 3 over 2. A bit more uh, simpl uh, simplifying, then you'll get 35 over 4 minus 15 over 4. And that is equal to 5. Therefore, you know that the area under this curve between root 3 and root 5, and the curve is x cubed plus x, is going to be 5. So the next problem involves slightly more problem solving. And this one says that an area is bounded by the curve y equals 4x cubed, and the x-axis, which is the line x equals 1, and the line x equals a, where a is more than 1. So what is the value of a if the area is 2,400 units squared? So to start this off, I'm just going to integrate at 4x cubed. So um, if you integrate 4x cubed, then you'll just simply get x to the 4. And now we're using what we learn in the last uh, first half of this um, video, and then we're going to do that b, so f of b minus a. However, it doesn't have to be, it can be the other way around. And because we know that a is bigger than 1, then we know that a is bigger, so then we're just going to do um, the a minus um, b. So if we substitute um, a in for x, then we get a to the 4. Then if you substitute 1 in for x, then we simply get 1. 
And we know that this is going to be equal to 2,400 because we know that this is what we're trying to find here is the area. And that is the way you find the area. And we've already been told the area in the question. So therefore, A to the 4 is equal to 2,000. 401 which means that if you did 2401 to the to the one quarter you'd write on your calculator then you know that a is equal to 7 and that is your answer so it's that simple you just have to uh, integrate first and then start putting it in to the way that you know um, that you work out the area of a curve. So thank you for watching this video and see you soon. Bye